people of the internet my name is Tim this is misunderstood photography and today I would like to take you through the process I went through in creating a one sheet for the 1978 John Carpenter classic Halloween I love October I love spooky time I am a big fan and I believe it harkens back to the wonderful memories I have as a child of this time of year I love dressing up I loved trick-or-treating, and I loved eating candy, watching horror movies. All things that I still do today. I figured I would continue the tradition that seems to happen every year at this time on this channel and create a Halloween poster. Previous years, I did my first iteration of John Carpenter's Halloween, followed by David Gordon Green's Halloween, and. David Gordon Green's Halloween Kills. Last year, I did Halloween Ends. So, for this year and this episode, I decided to take another stab at doing a 1978 Halloween one sheet, mostly because I have acquired some new artistic tools that I was really excited to use. I have gotten an iPad and an eye pencil and Procreate. And Procreate is a wonderful app that feels the end result feels like it was done with analog tools so an actual pencil on paper an airbrush paint canvas like all of it and i just wanted to see if i could get a more traditional look out of my art and i feel that i have accomplished that and i'm really excited to show you so Please, take my hand on this artistic adventure, and together we will all jump into Procreate.
And here we go. And I am, as per usual, really, really happy with the final result. I really love the color grade. I really love the composition. I had so much fun actually drawing this. And it's, it's a skill that I don't use as often. And I feel that ever since I got Procreate, I've been drawing all the time like I, I did when I was a teenager and very early in my artistic career and I'm just I'm happy to kind of go back to that I feel like I have kind of a sharper eye for some of the details my hand-eye coordination is back and I just I'm really happy with the final results it, it, it feels ever closer to that kind of style that I've been after my whole life trying to draw and paint and I just feel now that with the addition of Procreate to what I'm doing I just I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm a couple steps closer to that with all that being said I'm just I'm really happy with this poster I, I not to take anything away from the other series of posters that I've done but I just I feel like this one 
I, I, I'm a little bit more mature with my, my, my compositions now and my choices of color grade and just, just overall presentation. I just, I feel, I feel like this is, this is, this is so much better than what I've been doing. And I'm just, I'm really excited to see where this all goes next. So I'm super jazz. Have this one turned out. If you're super jazz, make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, tick the notification bell to let you know when I'm doing new videos. And please, please, please leave your comments and ideas down below. Let me know what you thought of this video. Let me know what you thought of this poster. If you have any ideas for other posters you'd like to see me do, leave them down below. I've also started an Instagram for all this poster stuff. If you'd like to check that out, the link is also down below. Thank you so much for joining me on this artistic journey this evening. Stay safe, stay spooky, and until next year, Happy Halloween!